hi guys uh, welcome to today's video and welcome to my youtube channel my name is Ardivian Munyazi uh, for the new ones and for the returning subscribers asante nisana uh, for always coming back to watch my video and in today's video it's a cooking video where i was just going to make a snack uh, which were donuts and then we are going to prepare dinner later so there i was just showing you the ingredients i'm going to use for everything and and, uh, I had milk, I had blue band, I had some cinnamon, I had some sugar, I had some icing sugar, I had some um, flour, uh, I had some, uh, what is it called, that one vanilla essence and yeast. So that is what we were going to use to to make our donuts today and uh see not everything is going to go uh into the dough so the first thing uh we are going to do um uh, is put i warmed my milk until it was warm uh, that i could place my finger in it and then i added some a little bit of sugar and then i added the one sachet of yeast i think in a kwanga five grams it's always five grams if i'm not wrong and then i'm going to just cover it and leave it for 10 minutes for it to uh, prove um a fizuri so yes guys and uh yes guys and then after that um we after here it has already it had already proven uh for 10 minutes or 15 minutes then i added two two <laughs> i had two eggs and then i added the vanilla essence and then i mixed then i will add some flour and a little bit of a little bit i'll add more sugar than what i added in the in the milk mixture uh, i'll add approximately three cups of flour or two and a half cups of flour uh, yeah and then i'll knead it and then i'll put some some blue band and then i'll knead it i'll knead it uh, i learned uh if you want a soft dough you have to knead it like you need it properly and one uh, weakness that i had uh, when dealing with dough uh, was not having patience of kneading the dough guys so sometimes things most of the times things is not okay visually sometimes not okay angomo but uh, these days this year i purposed to be patient in my kneading and that is what i do um and i mostly time myself because i just don't know when it's okay so they say around uh some say six or eight minutes so may I go with eight minutes yes and but sometimes i go with six minutes when i get too lazy i make sure it's around six minutes so that is what we're going um to do and if you haven't subscribed kindly subscribe to my channel for more cooking uh or i should say i do videos around cooking cleaning and lifestyle once in a while so if this is the type of content you like kindly consider subscribing and if you've been here for a while also consider subscribing today and uh don't forget to like the video and also share me if you can started as a whisper message from a new world i
so guys i kept my dough uh i warmed my oven kidogo and then um as i was kneading the dough uh, and then i zimmered it and then it was like uh, a little bit warm because i didn't want to take three hours proofing the dough so the easier way i do is i um warm the the oven maybe at 130 degrees for like 10 minutes until it's just uh, warm enough because uh kwanza like the way it's raining nowadays one time it's raining the next minute it's cold and windy and then the next minute um it's too hot so i didn't want to take chances and i didn't want the dough to stay for three hours so i just warm the oven and then i put it there and then in 20 or 30 minutes the dough is fully proven and it's okay so here i was just going to roll it and then i was just going to i didn't want my donuts to be big but also uh i realized i had rolled it too much but either way it was going to prove again and then yes so that is what we are going to do and i've cut uh, some is it baking paper or grease paper i've cut it into a uh, small sections that i'm going to uh, put my donuts there so it's going to be easy to put them um inside uh to fry them yeah it's going to be easy for me to fry them So guys here I'm going to make uh, the glaze I think they are called glaze because uh, I want to glaze uh, the donuts uh, in different ways I was making the, the donuts for my daughter and then some I'm going to take to uh, a friend's <coughs> sorry guys to a friend's um, son so I was just putting different uh, ones so I had three uh, in mind uh, one I was going to make one with icing sugar but I wish I had sprinkles but I didn't have any and I didn't see the need to at uh, rush to the supermarket which is a bit um, just to buy sprinkles so the first one was the one with icing sugar and all I needed was icing sugar which did I really measure I think I measured and then only more too. So and then with a little bit of um, milk. So I was putting kidogo milk and then uh, kidogo milk and then a uh, mixing and then I added a little bit of vanilla essence. Yeah, vanilla essence. Yes, guys. So that was uh, my first uh, glaze.
so guys the second one that i'm going to use was uh chocolate so it is not the real chocolate but if you have some uh chocolate chocolate uh, you can melt that and then add milk and then it will be okay but just here yeah, just had some drinking chocolate and that is what i was going to use uh because i want to finish at uh, this batch uh before it got it gets spoiled um so i added the the chocolate then i added a little bit of sugar because it's a little bit sweet but i just wanted it to be sweeter because they just treats for the kids so i wanted it to be a little bit uh, more sweeter and then after adding that uh the next option uh i could have added some cornstarch guys to make it thicker but i forgot but i'm going to add it later so i added that then i'm going to add milk kidogo by kidogo and then after that i'll put it uh, on the fire and let it simmer uh, so as i've said i'll add a cornstarch later which is going to make it uh thick visual you know uh because this one it's thick but it's a little bit runny so thick that it can stick um on a donut so that is what we are going to do for my next is it glaze or topping about us make up this time for us make up my mind about us yeah but believe me i try So my next one was going to be just uh, sugar and cinnamon. I think I love sugar and cinnamon and this one uh, didn't turn too sweet so it was uh, nice if uh, she wanted a bite of something that is not uh, extremely uh, sweet so it's just sugar and I'm going to put some cinnamon and just mix it well and then uh, this one I'll, I'll use uh, hot, I think, yeah hot. Uh, when they are just from uh, the oil i'll use them hot to just uh coat them though if she gave his oil. So when I was uh, glazing these uh, donuts with the icing, uh, I noticed when they are hot, uh, the icing was melting away. So I decided for the icing and for the chocolate, I let them uh, be warm kidogo and then uh, I will uh, glaze them. So here it was a, 
a while uh, later I had glazed both um, yes and this is uh, the turnout the baby girl was so happy she like ate a lot a lot of these donuts at, at the same time like she was excited uh, because of the different um, a glazing that they had i i have made donuts before uh but uh, like twice uh but this one zilik was mbamba kabisa because i think they were different they were sweeter and the difference just the because one day she was having the chocolate one the next day she was having the icing one and then your screen guinea she was having the cinnamon ones and she was really happy and that one made me uh really happy so after that i decided to clean as i go i'm really i'm really trying guys so here i was just cleaning the cooker making sure it is uh, ready for my make my next uh, meal so after the cooker yes after the cooker i was going to wash our uh, utensils uh, i'll just show you the uh, before and the after i won't show you me washing the utensils so this was a little bit later uh, after i had uh, finished showing you the before uh, the steamers uh, went uh, the steamers uh, we had a blackout yes we had a blackout and um so the after was when we had no electricity so i needed the door i let it rest uh, so yeah i was just uh, making uh, the chapels uh so for dinner we are going to have some chapels and some beans uh for the beans this time i didn't want to put uh any uh coconut milk so it was just a curry by its own no milk no nothing just just a simple uh simple coconut uh, not a simple coconut a simple beans stew and uh, nowadays i'm putting my i'm adding a little bit of butter in my uh, chapatis i'm liking them that way so here i was just uh, preparing them and guys i prepare 10 chapatis when i prepare more than that trust you me they will stay they will stay they will stay until i throw them away kwanza uh, now the baby i think when she's not in school she's not that super hungry because she wakes up a little bit late she eats um dinner uh, not dinner she eats breakfast late so that means she eats lunch late so she's not getting that hungry like she's not she's just playing and playing and playing so if i cook more than 10 um they're going to stay a lot and that is wastage of food which we are really trying to minimize um, in the house for the moment
so uh, here I had uh, put uh, it was time for me to prepare the beans uh, the bean stew and I've used the red onions I've put some cr um, crushed garlic and ginger then after that I'm going to put some uh, blended tomatoes and then um, I'll add some after they have cooked for a while I'll add some tomato paste then i'll add some maggi cube some beef cube uh is it beef cube beef the ones that then is the as a brown kubwa with the silver covering um and then i'll put some curry powder and then that was going out uh, to be it for uh my spices and on uh with this meal i'm using the wairimo or the wanjiros i don't know guys the small 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 uh, tiny red beans i'm really liking uh those ones uh lately uh for the gas i think they have a little bit of gas but um i put a whole carrot while uh, blending them does it really work completely not completely completely but it helps it really really uh helps started as a whisper message from a new So uh, that is how I prepared my uh, dinner on this day. Uh, that small plate is for the baby girl and it had a little bit of uh, veggies. I don't like veggies with my chapos so much. So I didn't put on mine and see you on the next one.